we always are interested to explore、uh, some unique and new repertoire and good pieces, and、uh, it is always our、um, our wish list is to do a CD for a concerto for two pianos and orchestra, and this is especially、uh, challenging because there are not many pieces in the standard repertoire. Right. So、um, we came across、uh, from、uh, Ralph from Williams Concerto, and、uh, we really feel deeply about the piece. So we think this piece should be heard a lot more. Von Williams、uh, wrote a piano concerto in and、uh, premiered、uh, in late、uh, around 1940s, but he found out it was not a success at all because of the sheer massive sound from the orchestra. Which was not a good balance with the one solo piano, so he rearranged this piece and perform. I mean,、uh, premiered in 1943, and、uh, for two pianos. Yeah, for two pianos,、mm -hmm. and、uh, so. But for some reason, this piece just wasn't recorded on、uh, as popular as、uh, uh, Mozart, Mendelssohn, and Poulenc, which everybody、uh, does. So we think this piece is so fantastic because this piece was written. Definitely heavily influenced by what was going on in Europe at that time, so you could hear some sort of the effect or atmosphere of wartime, at least to me. And the second piece is the、uh, Harold MacDonald. That's also quite a find.、Um, this recording would be the first modern recording、uh, because there is already an LP in existence of the piece's premiere done by Philadelphia Orchestra, conducted by、uh, Leopold Stokowski. And that's a wonderful recording too. But for the first time,、uh, we have a modern technology to show how good this piece is. And the, pl the places we have performed this piece, the audiences love it. The last movement is a Mexican dance. Again, it's a very American because you have the European tradition, and as if you wanted to break away from it. And and the very、uh, there's some jazzy rhythm, percussiveness, the urban, then balanced with the、uh, the European.、Um, Musical structure, yes. So, good piece. Dana Swiss, she's. I've never even heard of her until Victor and Marina mentioned her name, and I say, you know, of course we love to try new things, but it has to be good pieces. We found、uh, there's a salon pianist. His name is Peter Minton, and before Dana Swiss died, she left a lot of、uh, all her stuff to him. And so through him, he sent us a score, and there, Christina and I were looking at this handwritten score, trying to figure out what what's what. Then the minute we played, it was like this is unbelievably beautiful. Her music's got Gershwin. I mean, she was called the girl Gershwin, but I think she has her own unique style. She also、uh, studied in in France, so there's some impressionistic colors. Then she wrote a lot for the Broadway, the jazzy, the、um, pop music. Yeah, and even a little bit to me, it sounded like the Hitchcock film music. There's <laughs> enigmatic, the the beauty, the sensuality. It's just very amazing. <laughs> 